Hey everybody, welcome. It's Mike from Monkey Fab. I just want to talk about this. So we've added this to the website. All you really, I don't know, you can't buy it. You can't come here and buy it. But what you can do is just click on this little link right here. It'll take you right to the store. Boop! And you can get it right here. And Joe's going to give me a discount. So uh, today's the 2nd of August, 2023. Give me a couple days and I'll have that discount code for you and you'll be good to go. Uh, yeah, so I just add this to the site. Um, I, I'm not making any money off of it. Uh, it. Just, I just want you guys to have this. This was great. This was great for me. I'm a car guy. I'm an engine guy. I went to school for building engines uh, and, and happened to know a couple things. I'm not like a genius. I'm not a professional. I'm not, I'm not Brian Tooley or, or, or uh, Steve Morris or any any of these big. I, I just, uh, I fiddle with trash. <laughs> I like to make it go fast. That probably is, is a good portion of y'all. Probably 70, 75% of y'all are in the same boat as me. Um, so getting an engine together and knowing how it's supposed to run is, uh, that's simple. But using the Holly and understanding the software, well, that's that's challenging for me and it might be for you too. Maybe you're a, a senior uh, Gen Xer like me <laughs> and, and not everything with the computers makes sense anymore so uh they keep screwing it up you ever notice they just keep changing it it's because of boomer bosses but anyway uh yeah if you don't know anything about computers or what an engine needs and this isn't going to do anything for you you're going to have to figure that out first so if you don't know anything about engines and don't know uh basically the theory and what's supposed to happen when and where and how and why or have some sort of grasp on that then Go, go to a tuner, go to a tuner, let them do this, and it's gonna save you all kinds of agitation. If you wanna learn, then you need to learn, but you gotta learn the theories of engines uh, before, at least get a grasp on that before you even get a really around to this stuff. Uh, yeah, so that is that is what we got here, and uh, here is the Holly software. This is the version two. This is my little naturally aspirated Volvo wagon tune right now, and I get this. I get a map, I understand RPM versus load. We get that, right? Understand timing. I know what the I know what the engine should be, you know, around at, at what level of load and RPM. It's pretty easy. If you don't understand that, then this course probably isn't for you. I'll just be honest. I mean, it could be for you if you go through and do the reading and the work to get there, but it's gonna need some work for you uh, to get there. And there's no one, no one's gonna give you answers. You can't just buy this and somebody's gonna give you all the answers to tune your car. You're gonna have to do the work. But if you're willing to do the work and wanna learn, this is a great thing. What Joe does, there's so many tables in here, and this is the problem with the software, is what does all this stuff do? Uh, you got a fuel graph. Ooh, look how lumpy that thing is. Um, the learn table, the air fuel ratio, what numbers, you know, you, this is, again, Joe's not going to give you the answers to this stuff. You're going to have to kind of understand what's going on and why, but he does give you the answers to a lot of things and like this stuff, like, what does this mean? What is the acceleration enrichment? I have a basic idea. I mean, basically it's just your, uh, what do you call this? An accelerator pump, right? <laughs> but he breaks it down and what these numbers do and he gives demonstrations. He's got like a little live thing set up and, and shows you exactly what the Holly does and how it responds to inputs, which is great. Um, the, t the timing stuff, this, uh, the idle stuff, this all helped me. What the P's and D's do, what putting different numbers in there does to the computer. Um, your actual IAC settings, how to set up your IAC, how to set up your throttle body. Um, all these things are great. So it takes about two weeks doing a couple hours a night to get through the course. What I did is I just took my shitty, it was okay. It, was, it wasn't, wasn't wonderful, but I had troubles. It wasn't running uh, smoothly and it kind of cut out under certain situations, just little things, but generally ran good. Uh, I took that tune and just opened it up and I went through Joe's course. And as he was talking about, let's say he was talking about uh, the acceleration enrichment. I just looked, I opened up this and he would talk and he'd say something relevant and I'd pause the video and I'd go over here and look and see what I had going on. And then uh, if he suggested uh, different things, we'd add those and then take the car out and see what it would do and make adjustments from there and then go back and on to the next course. And we just go through that. And at the end of that two week period, uh, the car runs really good, really good. Best it's both my project cars, my Phoenix and my wagon have been running. And that's what, it, what I really needed was somebody just to break this down and show me like, what does, what does putting in a different number in here mean? Why is my idle not idling well? What does enabling the spark do? What does that do? 
Um, what is the IAC? How does it interrelate to things? All of these little things. He wasn't really telling you, you know, like, here's how you put in a tune to make 800 horsepower. That's not the point of it. The point of it is to teach you this holiday software. I think you'll get bits and pieces of uh, other things that are going on and, uh, you know, things you should do and do. But this isn't, this isn't like I'm going to send you a tune. This is like you have an, un an understanding of what your air fuel uh, and your timing stuff should be based off of what you've built and what you have in your vehicle. And now you need to get it to run well. So with that in mind, I think this is a fabulous deal. This is the best money I've spent in a long time. Whatever I paid for it, I would have paid probably three times as much as that. Because now I know and I'm much more educated and I can help other people too, which is nice. So that's why I'm adding this to the website and why I'm doing it free. I'm not getting anything from Joe. I'm just putting it up there. It's for you guys. And, and you guys should appreciate that too, that while Joe needs to be reimbursed for his time for doing this, he's done a great service. Uh, and I think it's well worth it. So that's why I'm adding this to the website. I hope that helps you guys. Again, I'm just going to say the divide is there. Either you understand how to make an engine work and the theory behind it, or you don't. And if they do, and you're having trouble with the tuning part, the actual computer interface stuff and whatnot, then this is a, a tremendous value. If you think you're just going to buy this and then have your car tuned remotely or something of that sort of effect, or just bug pe people, or they're going to tolerate your questions. But uh you know, after a while, it's going to be obvious that you're just not putting in the work. So you'll probably get ignored. But uh, on the forms, you get a whole private uh, Facebook form with this as well to ask questions and people help each other out, which is really nice as well because sometimes you just get stuck and you need a phone a friend. So I've rambled on for seven minutes now. I apologize, but I wanted to let you guys know about this, why it's there, and what value it brings and who it applies to. So I appreciate you guys checking out the video. Until next time, it's Mike Monkey Fab signing out.